Well, hello everyone, welcome back to Elden Ring on Playframe. And this tunnel that I got myself into using my... Um... Skill. Let's say. Doesn't matter how we did it, at the end of the day, I got in here. And I'm going to keep go- actually, hang on. I've got... If not runes, probably something I should look into over here before I go... Charging ahead further. Uh, not enough to level up, sadly, but we did get another Ashes of War, though. I still only got these three armaments, though. No, I thought I got another one. What did I pick up? Maybe it's something that goes on a different kind of weapon. That could be. Eh. Wait. No, never mind. <laughs> uh. Cool. Yeah, alright. Well, let's just go on ahead. Now, I realize, um, that in the first couple episodes here, I've been kind of just charging ahead without <laughs> really stopping to explore around very much. That will change. I'm like, uh, I could see myself getting very overwhelmed and just spending an entire couple of weeks of this playthrough just in the very, very opening map you want to, um, in the very opening area we started in back here, just like checking every little building and nook and cranny. I actually kind of do want to go back there and poke around a whole lot more. I just figured first, let's just press on ahead until Elden Ring basically gives me a brick wall and says, you should slow down. Because <laughs> I kind of expect it's going to at some point. Then I kind of want to go back to these early areas, buy some more of those um, recipes... There's a word for it. The recipes uh, for crafting and explore all the nooks and crannies, because I bet there's a ton of cool stuff around here that I just completely skipped. But uh, for now, we charge ahead and... Oh, a summon sign. Sorcerer Rogier. Tempting. Well, let's see how we do on our own first, huh? I mean, I don't even see anything. Other than a very good view. Good view. Oh dear. Foul tarnished. Yeah. In search of the Elden Ring. Emboldened by the flame of ambition. Odds are good, I would say. Whoa! Aggressive type. And very strong. Okay. Well, here goes. Margit. Alright. Big swipe. Kind of a one-two. Oh, follow-ups. Nasty V. Hey! Eek. Trying to get out of range of this nonsense. Thank you very much. Oh boy, that delay. I was expecting you to drop a lot sooner. Hmm. Alright, so you got throwing attacks. You got whatever this is. Yikes. And a follow up. Nah. Yeah. Or that one two with the uh, throne weapon. Nasty. Yeah. Too early. I might be in trouble. I think Elden Ring might be saying no. Very possibly. Nope. Ah, oh, come on. Okay. <laughs> You're the boss.
maybe it's time to go back and explore a little bit, huh? I've decided it's a good time for that. So, let's take advantage of this cool teleportation system that we just have now. And try going to, like... Hmm... Stranded Graveyard. Okay. Because I have, I think, an item that's going to get me in here now. And I'm very curious. Use Stone Sword Key? Not enough Stone Sword Key. I thought I did have one. I thought I'd, like, uh, picked one up. Maybe I imagined it. Starting to think I might have. Huh. Losing my mind, I guess. Well, whatever. So... Back out here at Limgrave. We could try picking that fight again. I'm not that much stronger, though, honestly. So maybe better to just explore a bit. There's lots of area I've not even started looking at. Maybe today's a good exploration day to see what sort of cool things we can find. Like, just looking at this map here, I guess it's hard to kind of pinpoint what may or may not be points of interest just looking at it, but, like, stuff like that seems like there's got to be something in that... And it's like a beach down here. There's all kinds of stuff in this landmass that I've barely touched. Verticality may be something of a concern. Eventually. Hey, birds. What's up? Do you drop anything? You do. Flight pinions. Okay. Resources. For crafting things. I should try to get some runes so I can buy more of those recipes, whatever they're called in-game. Because I want to start kind of digging into these systems a little bit more. Hmm. Well, let's just go down here. See where Whimsy leads us. It's a bit of a drop. How bad's fall damage in this? I guess we can find out. What's up? Ah. Oh. Come here. Y'all might be easier to fight on foot, actually. <laughs> Maybe doing all that on horseback was a mistake. And I can't jump. Yeah. Unpleasant bug thing. Don't care for that. Hey. Come here. There we go. A great dragonfly head. See, I'm already finding all kinds of great treasures. How deep and dangerous is this? Not very. Well, this is nice. Hmm... Anything particularly interesting. Ooh, shiny. There's a fire with a lot of guys around. There's also something moving there. What is that? What is that? Oh, goodness. Options everywhere. What is this thing? Um... What are you doing? Oh... Poisons, I see. No more poisons, please. Sturdy thing. Whoa! Okay! <laughs> I see that I have made an error. 
when choosing directions. Um, horse, now may be an excellent time to get me out of here. Horse, horse, horse. Go, dear. Run. Top off and run, horse. Horse, why did you lead me here? I blame you. Where is that thing? Somewhere else, hopefully. Run. We're fine now, right? Oh, yeah. Nothing to worry about. Totally good. Whew. Well, good to know some directions are smarter than others to wander. Yeesh. How are you fellas doing? Yeah, horse fighting is sometimes just difficult. This is easier sometimes. Hmm. So that's where we kind of first started fighting a bit up that away. Let's just kind of keep following the road this way. See what happens. How's it going? Oh, are you just hiding? Eh, fair enough. I would too. There's a dragon over there. Look out. Hmm. I see these little statues around occasionally. Are these the... This is kind of one of the alternative respawn points, yeah? I assume yes, because I see... A, uh... Another horseback rider. I want that, though. Hmm. Okay. Charge it. Keep charging it. Come here. Don't you run away. There we go. Nice. Interesting to get ashes from those things. Oops. Ah, oh, come on. My follow-up. It was going to be so good. Got to start learning when and when not to do that. <laughs> eh. Messing me up over here. There. That's a thing to do. Yeah. Look out. Hey, guy, do you mind? I was dealing with these folks. You're interrupting. Ow! <laughs> it's getting a little out of hand. Calm down, please. Eh. You. All right, got you. Got you too. Now it's just you, nuisance. I wonder if fighting you on horseback would be easier. Possibly. Because your horse also seems to have an HP bar that I'm working through. You know what? Why not? Look out. Oh boy. In a bit of trouble here. It's fine. Yeah. Got a little bit, um, greedy. <laughs> Gotta remember, you can run from these things. Oh. Sure. Oh, and the weather changed. That is cool. Let's get those back. Maybe this time initiate with a little bit more smarts and intent. Although it's going to be kind of hard to. They're going to see me. Haha! -ha. Got one of you at least. There we go. Hey, a dagger. Nice. Finally, another weapon. 
Now where's that writer? I'd love to sneak up on him this time. And while I'm waiting, it's kind of nice. You can craft while you wait. I could make more of these. Need to figure out how to use those. On horseback, feed to torrent to restore HP. So I guess to, re to restore torrent's HP, probably not mine. That wouldn't make a lot of sense, would it? So, okay. Stealth attack on... Rider. I like my chances. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. Hmm. Let's try it again. Should probably find a better moment to do that in the future, but, you know. All right, all right, all right. Tricky, but... Kind of... Oh. Horse is down. Fair enough. It's all right. I'll figure it out. Come on. I'm gonna get you. Ah, can't believe your attack landed first. Well, I can, but still. I'm going to get you. Hmm. There we go. Gotcha. Oh, you were gonna shout at me. What was that move? I win, though. Ha ha. And I got a smithing stone. Heck yeah, I could upgrade this weapon if I wanted. And I kind of do. It's working pretty well for me as a starting weapon. Hmm. Really, really enjoying the addition of... Ah, come on. Stealth is more of a usable mechanic in this. It's pretty great. Now then, so we've done all that. Got us some butterflies. Ooh. Giants pulling a thing. That's probably not a smart fight to pick. Where am I at this point? Oh, all the way out here. Okay, cool. Hmm. Could keep heading south. We found the dragon burnt ruins. Boy, they sure were. What's like down here, though? I'm kind of curious about that. Or any of these other buildings. Kind of seems like this world could just be full of weird stuff in any old nook and cranny. Hmm. There's definitely, like, wildlife everywhere. Various soldiers and troops everywhere, although they seem pretty easy to ignore if you're on horseback. A lot of them, anyway. Not all, probably, but a lot. Hmm. Oh. Whoa. The heck are you? Don't know if I like you yet. No, you're fine. Whatever you are. Oh, geez, there's a lot of them. I don't like how much you shout. <laughs> I'm leaving. <laughs> yeah, let's see if we can get around behind these folks, because I don't know... Like, I'm tempted. I'm curious, like, what would be in this? Could I get into it? 
It does seem like it's a chest or something, right? Like, what if? Oh. It's in a ride. Ah, oh, but I want that. I wonder. Surely it's not a thing where, like, this is a chest I could have if I... If I took out the two giants pulling it, right? Surely not. I bet they're very strong. Not very attentive, though. And you know what? They seem like they're having a hard enough day. Let's just keep following the road, see where it takes us. Love all the wildlife scattered around. That's something I'm not really used to. Gracious, there's a lot of, a lot of dudes. Not used to seeing like tons of endemic life in uh, Souls games. Anyway, waypoint ruins, huh? Interesting. Uh, don't like how much that's moving. Oh, okay, nope. Go. Oh, I definitely don't. Intense flower. This is very cool and a dangerous place to be, I think. <laughs> Could be getting in over my head again, seeing how much poison is just flying around that area right now. I kind of love these, though. Flowers scurrying toward me. Don't shake poison at me. No! Stop. No, oh, no. No. No to that. No to that. Does feel like I'm getting over my head a little, but... Who knows what cool things I got. Hidden back here flowers. See, there's an item. I could just have it. Die. Die. No. There we go. Miranda powder. Glowstones. All kinds of fun goodies. Ha! Ah, surprise! Are the little flowers respawning constantly? That's a thing I've not detected yet. I do seem to be thinning out the crowd a little. Stop it! With the poison. Just quit. Yeah, no, I got all the little ones. Alright. Uh. Do I dare? Yeah, cast your spell. Oh boy. Strong. Strong and sturdy. Woo! Okay, don't be standing in front of it when it does that. Seems like a bad thing to do. Oh, huh. got some cured meat. What are you doing? Okay, if it aims straight up, then it's... firing that stuff off everywhere. Don't be there. When that happens... I wonder if, like, rain affects stuff like... Like this. Like this sort of, like, poison pollen flying around. Probably not much, but it'd be kind of cool if it did. I'm gonna get you. I'm determined. Don't be in front of it. Don't be around that either. Okay. Okay. Uh, firing upwards. Okay. <laughs> I wish I had a ranged option. 
One of the other starting classes would have given me one. I'll get one eventually. I guess I do have some... I probably picked up some, like, throwing knives, or I could have crafted some at some point. I'll have one eventually. And for now, I'll make do. Chill with the poison already. Run! That's right. Do your little shotgun blast. I don't even care. I'm gonna get ya. Oh boy. Look out. Do it, I dare ya. Yes. Yes. Gonna get you. Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! Take that flower. A poison bloom. Neat. A lot of them. Cool. I earned that. <laughs> what else do I earn by coming out here? Uh... These structures are all super cool. I can't quite tell if I should be, like, trying to, uh, explore all of the nooks and crannies more thoroughly. Like, maybe. Yeah? Ruined fragments abound. It's a big world. <laughs> Kind of intimidated by the size of the world in front of me here. So where are we, and where do we want to be? We're kind of getting outside the borders of the known map currently. I'm going to set a marker here. Oh, we got like a lot of kinds of markers. Interesting. Let's... Uh... Hmm. Hmm. I guess, like, a point of interest structure there, maybe? There. Yeah, let's try heading in that direction. I think I'm pointed that way. Generally. Let's get there before the episode ends and see what's out there. How's our soul count looking, by the way? Or our rune count? I'm going to make that mistake constantly. Just kind of get used to me using soul, bonfire, all these other terms kind of interchangeably. The soul's like really like conforms to the open world like design really interestingly I see crabs or a crab and some guys and a rider So, current location. We're getting there. Might need to get more on the road here. Let's do. Hello. What? Okay. That's a huge bear. Gah! All right, all right. Bear, chill. Bear is not chilling. Ow. Bear, I'm going. What is this? Yee! Whatever it is. Spirit spring jumping. Jump while on horseback near a spirit spring to ride its current into the air. You won't take damage from jumping into a spirit spring while on horseback, even from great height. Uh, let's use that to get away, maybe. Yee! Cool! Whoa! Is it gonna follow me? 
I have this sinking fear that it's going to follow me somehow. Boy. Angry bear. The heck is that? Glowing, like, wormy thing up there. Huh. Is that where I'm headed? It is. Well, I'm safe up here for a second. Let's see what's on this peak, if anything. Some guards. This thing. Hmm. What have we here? Starlight shards. Seems like it must be a crafting component. A lot of guards around here, kind of a, some ruined structures. There's so much stuff. It's hard to choose a direction to start. Okay. So, to get across here, you're a real good jumper, Torrent. Don't think I haven't noticed. Is that a bug? What is that thing? I'd rather tangle with it than bears. I don't think the bear's down there anymore. Thank goodness. Let's top off. Hey, let's use one of these uh, other items. These... Uh, these. Yes? Yes. No, wait, that's crafting. Let's use one of the items. Use. Okay, and so that does slowly heal the horse up. Cool. All right. Nice. I don't know if I can make this jump, but let's try. Woo! Yes! And here we are. Cool. Okay. Yeah, what are these things? There's a lot of them, and they're all pointed this way. Ooh, and there's one crawling around. Forlorn Hound Everjail. Huh. It's such a neat world already. So... Um... Hmm. Examine? Enter the Everjail? I don't know. Do I want to? I feel like I should find a... I haven't found a uh, grace in a little bit. Maybe, uh... Maybe I should? <laughs> Is there one nearby? Is light converging anywhere and, like noticeably super close by. I feel like I should find one of those first, and then go wandering in. Wait, there you are. Okay. You're not super close, but you're a lot closer than anything else I've found. And I'll take it. Heck yes. Okay. I should probably rest. <laughs> Hello. Forgive me. I've been testing you to see whether or not Grace truly does guide you. And? And whether you are fit to face the challenge that entails. It seems my worries were unfounded. Torrent had your measure from the very start, whereas I merely pretended. There is but one other thing I can do to offer you guidance. Yeah? I can take you to the round table hold. Huh. Gathering place of tarnished champions. Guided by grace. Sure. Very well. Let my hand rest upon you for but a moment. Oh. 
The Round Table Hold is a place where tarnished gather guided by grace. Combat is prohibited on the premises due to a pact of non-aggression. This rules in effect on the Round Table icons displayed. The Round Table Hold is located outside of this world. It can only be reached through Sites of Grace. It can also be accessed by using the map to travel. Cool. Uh, what do we do here? It's very pretty. I guess... Like, NPCs could hang here. And maybe some do? Hello. Oh, I see you've just arrived. Welcome to the Round Table Hold. I'm Corin, a man of the cloth. I teach incantations, the strength granted us by the two fingers, and explore the secrets of the Golden Order, so that one day, if a tarnished of the Round Table Hold should become Elden Lord, I might counsel them. Ensuring order regains its proper form, writing rule over men. By the way, do you still see it? The guidance of grace. I mean, I think so. I'm not, not in here necessarily. No, I, I kind of do. Does that count? I mean, you see that too, right? Let's just say yes. You do. Wonderful news. Most tarnished are blind to it these days. You are something of a rare breed. Well, what do you say? Care to learn an incantation of the two fingers? I mean, I'm game for it. I just don't know if my stats are. Let's see. Uh, urgent heal. Heals a small amount of HP. I've got enough faith for that one. That could be kind of fun. Uh, incantation heals self and nearby allies. Awesome. Uh... Cure poison, magic fortification, flame fortification. I wonder if magic, like, magic and ranged attacks. I guess it's hard to think about, like, Dark Souls 3 is maybe the closest ranged attacks got to being all that interesting or fun to do on the regular. Magic, though, like, can be very fun. I wonder, <laughs> I wonder if it's, uh, super fun option that I should be considering more strongly in the in Elden Ring. Maybe. Catch flame. I kind of want all these runes for other things though is the is the problem. May the golden order shine through you. And also with you. There was somebody else here. You. Hello. Ah, hello. You must be new here. I'm, well, just call me Dialos. Okay. The honor of one's house holds little import in these lands. By the way, have you met a young woman named Lanya on your travels? She's my servant, but fickle as the wind. Take your eyes off her for but a moment and she's good as gone. If you find her, please be sure to tell me. Lanya. Okay, I'll uh, keep an eye out. Be sure to tell me if you meet a young woman named Lanya. Right. She's a servant to my house. She's been my companion since childhood. I've lost count of the number of times I've had to find her like this. Honestly, she's such a little tomboy. I'll keep an eye out. Still kind of trying to rest at Table of Lost Grace. Still kind of trying to parse what this is. This seems kind of like my Firelink equivalent, weirdly, upon first impression. I mean, kind of seems to be. Um, you are interesting, aren't you? Oh, this is a rare occasion. I can't remember the last time a new tarnished made their way to the round table. Very well. As your senior, I bid you welcome. It is safe here. You may let down your guard. I don't really know how to sheathe my weapon, is the problem. Allow me a word of advice, as your senior. You are a mere visitor to the round table. Nothing more. A house guest. Yet to earn their keep. Remember your place, newcomer. I'll try to, I guess. Um, anything else? There's nothing left to say. 
be at your leisure. I will. Hmm. Got paths splitting off here. So, okay, starting from fireplace. If we hang an immediate right, we find... Oh. A smithy. Hello. You're a new face. No matter. It's all the same. Lay out your arms. Let's get smithing. Might just do that. Uh, about the chains on your legs. I see you've noticed the chains. Uh huh. Nothing special. I'm a prisoner, and these are my chains. I'm trapped by the hold. I'm dying, smithing for you fools. <laughs> That's all there is to it. Hmm. You're a prisoner? No. Don't read too much into it. Well, no grudge against you. My being a prisoner is no fault of yours. Besides, I don't mind smithing. Despite my differences, the weapons get stronger all the same. Given time, technique never fails. Besides, it helps me forget. The sheer terror of her. Hmm. Ash of War duplication, huh? Interesting. So if I have lost Ashes of War, I can create more of ones I've found, I guess? Okay, so, yeah, so I do have another Ash of War here that only works on curved swords and great swords and axes and hammers, so kind of like bigger ones, I guess. Neat. This system's neat. I'm going to need to explore this a lot. Maybe I should go ahead and, like, uh, put this on the like, level up the sword, one, and put, like, Storm Stomp or one of these others on it. I don't know. Strength and armament. We can at least do that. Let's go ahead. Make it stronger. Stronger sword. And then we can Ashes of War. Um, are we replacing what we have on it? I guess. Yeah, I guess we're, like, changing square off which I've not been using much, into one of these other two. I wish I could see, like, what the move is? Yeah, I wish I, wish I could see what the actual move is without applying it. You know, why not? Let's go with Storm Stomp, I suppose. Sure. Huh. Oh, and at the same time, like you're choosing the move, the art, the like Ash of War move, but you also get to choose like the stats. That's really interesting. That's really interesting. Let's stick with standard, because I'm not really, like, putting points into dexterity right this second, but, uh, sure. Interesting. Lots of new systems to learn. Tell you what, I get the feeling I'm going to be around here for a little bit. <laughs> Talking to people and kind of learning my way around. Let's call it a day, and, uh, I will see y'all tomorrow for more time here at the round table. Do take care, and uh, yeah, see you Friday. Bye. Hey! Or that. <laughs>